Oh shit, it's on fire. <laughs> in an accent for some reason. We are going to do something really cool, uh, something that's been highly recommended by many, many people. What accent is that? I have no idea. I'm <laughs> probably offending just about everyone. So Jordan, does this really cool thing that we're going to do rhyme with Lobo? Uh, Schmeshtable. Yes, it, I, I think it does, as a matter of fact. <laughs> you and these accents today. <laughs> Este festival se llama Globos. ¿Qué pasó? Cada año hay mucha No, sí, pasó cada año y hay mucha gente aquí. Hay un DJ, hay música. Este es una tradición que comienza en 1997. Ahora estamos hablando en español. No sé por qué, pero estamos. Sí, sí, todo en español. El tiempo es un poquito húmedo y calor, pero es un... Una... Pero es un poco nublado, así que es divertido. Sí, cada minuto hay un globo nuevo. Arriba. Este es el parte. Oh my gosh, it's on fire. Oh shit. Oh gosh. It's heating up. <laughs> Where the festival global goes wrong. Ah, oh gosh, oh gosh. <laughs> Qué mal. Hay mucho, uh, creo que hay mucho trabajo en todos los globos. Y Arriba en fuego. En fuego. like five minutes and some friends of ours just told us that one of them got stuck in the power lines and just zapped it which was quite a spectacle and then one just lit on fire what I want to know is these things look like they're going like hundreds or thousands of feet or miles hundreds of miles where do they end up they just fall in people's backyards and all of a sudden you have a, a hot air balloon thingy in your backyard or something <laughs> that's got to be a fun surprise for someone ¿Qué es este? ¿Qué pedo? About every minute another balloon goes up here. There's so many people, there's a lot of energy, tons of vendors, announcer, music, it's a lot of fun. It takes a half dozen people to get one of these off the ground. At least. So, in something like freshman year, I was in a biology class or some type of science class, and we made balloons like these out of tissue paper and lit them up. But I don't remember having to put something on them. Like each one has like a this one had a bag filled with water. Uh, it makes sense to like counterbalance it. Yeah. I think the one that lit on fire, maybe it didn't have <laughs> So they just roped off this crime scene here. Or soon to be crime scene. Oh my gosh, Jordan. We almost made it inside. What do you think is going to happen? More balloons <laughs> going up. We're going to have to see what's going to happen. Oh yes, we'll... we shall see what's going to happen with these balloons. I think this one's going to be huge. 
Yeah, this is gonna be the biggest no, one yet. No wonder they had to rope off this, gi this giant square here. Someone told us that last year they were sitting in the stands and a balloon caught on fire and went into the stands. I guess when I was picturing that, I was picturing a balloon about, I don't know, a foot in diameter. <laughs> this one is gonna be a gargantuan. Yeah. Can you see what the balloon says? No. Do you want to go over my shoulders so you can see? No, last time you dropped me, you just about dropped me on the floor. I have never dropped you. Not hard. Mira. <laughs> <laughs> mentiroso. Mentiroso, mentiroso, pantalones en fuego. <laughs> this is the gigantic one going up right now. I think it's the biggest one we've seen yet. We'll see if it starts on fire and goes into the crowd. <laughs> Hope not. <laughs> Disaster. Oh god. Oh no. It's too good to be true. Too big to be true. Sad. <laughs> Over on this end, there's a pink SpongeBob going up, so we're gonna go check him out. It's Patrick. He's a starfish. <laughs> definitely, definitely not a, a pink SpongeBob. It's a Patrick. It's not a sponge or a Bob. <laughs> suspicions that this was going to be kind of lame but this is super cool I mean seeing all of these in the air one caught on fire and waiting for someone else to get a or not someone something some other balloon to get electrocuted <laughs> So looking up behind us here, you can just see tons and tons of balloons up there, and one just burned up. <laughs> In the air. Yeah. Oh no! Bugs Bunny is muriendo. Oh my god. Seems like anyone can put a balloon up. I'm kind of sad that we didn't make a tangerine balloon. <laughs> Like to know. I would like to know. Double owl pun. Double, double pun tundra. Pun <laughs> tundra. <laughs> So in that one we just saw go up, this one had a bag of water. They need to let out a little bit of water because it was slightly too heavy and it went straight up.
I estimate their chance of survival increases tenfold once they get about 50 feet up in the air. Muchas matemáticas. <laughs> this is like weirdly fun. I mean, stuff is lighting on fire, stuff is getting electrocuted, people are running around, kids are screaming. What's that to like? <laughs> I've always been kind of a pyro and I keep running towards the fires. <laughs> oh my god. Did you think this was going to be so fun though? No, I didn't. Interesting? But yeah, I would come here every year. Yeah. And it's free. It's free as well. And next year, Tangerine Travels Balloon, if we're still here. So we've been here for two, maybe two and a half hours, and this is non-stop balloons, just one after the other. I, I originally thought this might be like a one, two, three, lift off, and then like a hundred balloons go in the air, or 50 or something. And but I thought they were going to be small balloons. Like. And there's, some of these are huge, like yeah. just gigantic. This thing is massive. These huge ones don't have a good chance of surviving though. We'll see if it works. Really hope you liked this video. We really enjoyed making it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And one last thing. <laughs> Gong, that bell. <laughs> so you get notified the next time we go to a balloon festival or something else. <laughs> and we'll see you there.